Rachel Swedberg is the executive director of Casa for Kids. Rachel, talk about what the mission is of Casa for Kids and how does it relate to Child Abuse Prevention Month, which is April? Absolutely. So our mission is to advocate for children in the community who are currently in foster care and have experienced abuse or neglect. This looks like a lot of different things. Sometimes the children are still in home with their families and we're able to work with the entire family unit. Sometimes those children are in foster care, in a group home, or maybe placed with a relative. But what we do is provide volunteers who ensure that those children's voices are heard throughout their entire court process, that their needs are met both in the community and in the court system, and that ultimately they're in a safe and supportive environment where they can thrive. And so Child Abuse Prevention Month goes hand in hand with our mission. We are part of a local council that is actually working to reduce and ensure that we have accurate and supportive measures to prevent child abuse. And so you'll see if you're driving around town, there's a lot of pinwheels out, and that's our visual reminder for you. Okay. You'll see them. Yes, take a picture if you can. We're doing the hashtag strengthening families. Everyone can strengthen families is the hashtag. Great. And what we're doing is just bringing awareness to the fact that child abuse does happen, but it is also preventable. Yeah. And so by having resources, supports, people in the community that are willing to support organizations like CASA, we can reduce the number of children who are experiencing this and hopefully prevent future experiences by breaking cycles. Yeah. And you have an event coming up on Friday, May the 3rd. Thus, this is what you brought in, because yes. this, this has something to do with it. Deb is emceeing. Tell us about the event. Yes, we are very, very excited. So this is our 10th annual evening to change a child's story. So our first decade wrapping up. This is our largest fundraising event where we bring in the largest amount of our operating and program expense funding essentially. And we really do that through the support of community members. And so uh, what we will do at the event, it'll be May 3rd at Eagle Eye Golf Center and Banquet. And what we're gonna be doing is really just celebrating what CASA has done over the last three decades that it's been in existence. And we will have a silent auction, a live auction, baskets like this one, and you'll see some of the baskets um, that we also are gonna be auctioning off in the images behind. But we're really excited. We're, we're very excited to just have the opportunity to connect with the community, celebrate what CASA is doing, how we're changing children's stories, and ensure that we have funds to continue doing so in the future. And if someone can't join us on May 3rd, there are lots of ways to support. CasaForKidsInc.org is the website for more information. Rachel, thank you for the work that you do, and we hope to see everybody coming on May 3rd. Thank you.